So in this video, we're going to learn how to manually install OTA updates to our Nexus and Pixel phones. Uh, you're going to have to have ADB already installed on your computer to do this. Uh, if you don't have that set up, I'll have a link in the description to a video that I made on how to do that. Uh, once you have that set up, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is head over to the website where you can download your OTA updates. I'll have a link to this website in the description of the video. You're going to scroll down and you're just going to find your phone. So if you have a Pixel, you just go to the latest one there. I will be using a Nexus 6P, so I'll get the latest one here. And these are incremental, so you don't want to like jump from February to June. You'd want to do all of them. Anyway, download this. It's actually going to take a little while. It's quite a large download, so it's going to take a few minutes. Now while you wait for that to download, you're going to want to go to your phone and get that prepared for the update. And you want to go to settings. You're going to want to scroll all the way down and go to about phone, and then scroll all the way down to build number and tap that seven times. You're going to enable developer options. So go back and then you'll see the developer options appear there. You're going to click that and then go to USB debugging and turn that on. Go ahead and click OK. And then you want to plug your phone into your computer. You're going to get a little pop-up that says uh, allow USB debugging. Go ahead and click the box that says always and then click allow. After you do that, open up terminal on your computer and then type in ADB devices and hit return you'll see a little serial number pop up and it'll say device. That's exactly what you want. And then go ahead and type in ADB reboot recovery and hit return. Your phone's going to reboot. So then once your phone reboots, it's going to be in recovery mode. You'll see this little Android with the exclamation mark and no command. What you want to do is you want to hold down power and then tap volume up just like this and you'll see this menu come up. You're gonna to wanna to scroll down to apply update from ADB and tap power. So now that you have your update downloaded and your phone is prepared, go ahead and open up terminal and then type in ADB devices to see that your device is found. And then you're just gonna go ADB sideload and then find your OTA in the downloads folder and just drag it into the terminal window. You don't want that space that was right there, so go ahead and delete that, and then press return. It's gonna say loading, and it's gonna take a little while, so we'll go ahead and fast forward this, just let it sit for a little while. So once that finishes, you'll see you get a whole list of things that went on while it was updating, and at the very bottom you'll see install from ADB complete. Once you see that, you can just go ahead and use the volume down key to go all the way to the bottom and just hit power off with the power button. And then reboot, and you're all done. If uh, you found this video helpful, please subscribe, like, and comment if you have any questions, and also a thumbs up too.